You may have seen or heard the term mainline railways, but what are they and how do they differ from other railway lines? Firstly, and rather understandably, main lines can sometimes get mixed up with mainline. The mainline basically means the national railway network, excluding lines like urban metros, heritage rail, or privately owned infrastructure. Whereas typically, a main line describes a principal rail link between big towns and or cities. Historically, the term dates from the Victorian Railway Revolution, specifically the Liverpool and Manchester Railway, but also many others of the time. Historic main lines also included secondary routes and branch lines. Today, we have more names for different types of lines on the modern railway. Here are a few. Primary. These are high speed, high tonnage, mixed passenger and freight routes. London and South East. High density London commuter routes with varying tonnage of freight traffic. Secondary. These are through routes carrying mixed passenger and freight traffic. Meanwhile, rural lines carry lightweight and less frequent passenger trains. And freight means, you guessed it, freight trains only. So while most of Britain's railway is main line, main line routes are typically the major ones. But they all link people and goods and provide important connections between communities. That's why we work across the country every day to look after this historic, interconnected system and help keep Britain moving safely and reliably.